And now our sideline reporter, Doris Burke, has a report for our Sprite Spark of the game. Doris? Well, it's going to be James Harden. He's our Sprite Spark. He's turned in a wonderful performance off the bench, and you have to wonder if their lead would be this big without his great play in this one, guys. Thank you, Doris. He sure did stir things up for him. Boy, he was an injection of a different kind of energy out there. Got him going in the right direction and really gave him something the starters weren't able to give him. Well, give him credit. I mean, he was just waiting for his chance, and, and he took full advantage. Prince and Yurebko are the forwards. Ben Gordon out there with Brandon Knight, and it's Wallace in at the pivot spot manning the middle. That's the group for Detroit right now. Knight kicks to Yurebko. Knight. He's covered by Fisher. And he was fouled in the act of shooting. Chance here now for a three-point play. Yeah, we're now starting to see them get some high percentage shots in the paint. Yeah, that's five of their last six buckets inside the lane, so they're getting really high percentage looks down there. You know, one of the things we saw with Brandon Knight last season at Kentucky was that he really became better at making decisions on the court from early in the season to later on. And remember, in high school, he went to a small academic-oriented school. He was the opponent. Oh! Now let's check out the Spike Slam Camp. Now that's a special order right there. Not everybody can camp off a dunk like that. Yeah, very difficult maneuver, but a tremendous one if you can pull it off. Good luck. Thunder foul call. For the Pistons, Jason Max Seals checked in for your Eurepton. And it's Bynum in for Knight. on the floor. Pistons trail by 18. Now here's Bynum. Outside Gordon. Fires from deep. Kendrick Perkins grabs the miss. Perkins got six rebounds now in the game. And Fisher kicks to Durant. Fisher, the pass to Durant. Six to shoot. Fisher dishes to Perkins. Here's Ibaka. And their work on the board pays off with the second chance points. Here is Bynum. He's covered by Fisher. Bynum kicks to Prince. Wallace down low. He's against Perkins. Just five to shoot. Here's Prince. The Thunder pull it in. Earlier, they held a 23-point lead. Here's Cephalosha. Misses the three. Get down, get down. Pistons trail by 20. And here is Bynum. Defended by Durant. Bynum kicks to Prince. Backs him down. Over Cephalosha. Prince's shot is good. Got a piece of it. Bynum with the steal. You know, guys, you look at it, one turnover in the game, sometimes that can get overlooked. But I think it shows how well he's playing. I mean, he's really making the most of every possession. Boy, they are really getting chewed up inside here. I mean, that's eight of the last ten points they've given up inside, in the paint. Yeah, and the paint should be sacred ground for a defense. I mean, you can't let anybody just trot in there and get an easy bucket. A different look for Detroit. Greg Monroe, he's checked in for Wallace. Stuckey comes in for Tayshawn Prince. And Knight subbed in for Will Bynum. Now the Pistons with it. They trail by 16. Time called here. The Pistons decide to talk it over. They seem to have lost their mojo offensively. Probably a good time out here to try to get a play in and jumpstart their offense. The Thunder making a switch here. Harden's checked in. Out of bounds, and they'll keep possession. Oh. 
Here's Knight. Knocks it down from 19 feet. Knight's got five points in the quarter. Well, they're scrapping. I mean, they're giving it everything they've got, putting together a nice run here. Steve Wolf continue to see if they can chip away at it, but they've still got a long ways to go. Well, I guess they can get them when they need them. That's a good job of getting to the miss. Mm -hmm. Picked up by Collison. Takes it up, and he makes good on the way up. They got on this roll a while ago, and they just haven't looked back. Well, he's getting it warmed up now after that cold first half. Here is Cook. Back to Jackson. Here's Harden on the wing. He's guarded by Stuckey. Four on the clock. They need this. Harden's shot is good. And the Thunder lead by 14. Just cruising to the finish line. Yeah, and barring something catastrophic happening, um, it looks like they'll go home with a nice victory here. Now, here is Knight, guarded by Jackson. Top of the key, and the Pistons getting another bucket right there. Things are finally turning around for him. He's looked pretty good here in this half. Harden, he's guarded by Stuckey. The leader, and fouled hard that time. He'll get to the line and shoot two. They get Jason Maxiel. Yeah, plenty of contact there. Easy call. Steve, when you miss a shot like that, you know he got hit on the way up. You know, Clark, uh, they've been out-rebounded by a big margin here today. Yeah, but still, it's a close game, Kevin. It all comes down to maybe just a handful of plays here. One of the things the Thunder can definitely be encouraged by from last season was the growth of James Harden. I mean, started off the season slow. By the playoffs, he probably was their third best player. They could have used this run a while ago. It may not make much difference now. Yeah, they hit that snooze button a little too much because they showed up late to this game. He's feeling it, and he drops that one in. And that ought to do it. That should seal the deal. Yep, I agree. Closing it out with relish. Just two seconds between shot clock and game clock. He feeds it tonight. Guarded by Jackson. The offensive rebound. Tries again. Monroe lays it in without an inch of room around him. That's not a defensive matchup that's going to work out too often. I mean, it's hard to give up that much size. And here's Harden for three. So no problem for Oklahoma City as they get the win. Some days, Clark, everything goes right for a team, and they just had one of those games. Yeah, it certainly was. I mean, these guys played a great all-around basketball game here. Thanks for tuning in to the NBA on 2K Sports. For Clark Kellogg, Steve Kerr, and Doris Burke, this is Kevin Harlan. We'll see you next time. And now, our Jordan player of the game, James Harden.